As families get ready this week to send the kids back to school, we're looking at the changes local schools are making to keep kids safe this year. And it goes beyond hiring more armed guards. ABC Action News reporter Adam Weiner is live in Hillsborough County right now where officials spent the summer improving the security of school buildings. Good morning, Adam. Good morning there, Yaron. A lot of these schools across the Tampa Bay area, they've built new fencing, they've installed better locks, and they are launching new programs, new initiatives that they hope will better prepare students for all kinds of emergencies. In Hillsborough County, for instance, more schools are installing what are called emergency buzzers. They are special devices that can quickly alert police to an emergency. These are being installed across Hillsborough County and they're going to be showing up in schools over the next several months. We uh, also were there this summer watching officials take time to test the buildings themselves like the door and window locks and security cameras to make sure that everything works. You know, in today's world, we need to know who's on our campus, why are they there and how they get there. Um, and that's the reality of Parkland. That's the reality of Texas, Sandy Hook and all those other horrible events. Now, also new this year, uh, all kids are going to have what are called lockdown drills and run hide fight drills during the very first few weeks of school to prepare kids. Some schools are even asking uh, families to get what are called transparent or translucent backpacks. They're clear. Uh, they're to create a little bit of transparency about what kids have with them, but not all schools are requiring them. Some are. It is a school by school basis across the Tampa Bay area. So check with your school to make sure your kid has what they need as they head back to school over the next couple weeks. For now, live here in Hillsborough County, Adam Weiner, ABC Action News.